Boom. Okay, guys. Really quick, I'm going to show you all how to deploy a smart contract to the Ethereum test network. Particularly, what we're going to do is use the Ropstein text network. Ropstein. However, they, however you cool kids are pronouncing it these days. Um, but it really doesn't matter. You can do this exact same thing to deploy to the main net or whatever other flavor of test network you want to deploy your contract to, okay? All right, so here I have pulled up a really super simple smart contract uh, that I just called hello, okay? And there's just a public string called hello that contains the string hello world. That is it and that is all. So real quick, let's just compile that to make sure it's workable code so we're not just deploying random junk. So it appears to be compiled and let's go over here and test it out. So let's deploy it first. Let's just deploy it to the JavaScript virtual machine. Uh, it's going to auto select you to the Berlin hard fork. I mean, you can do London, something like this is not really going to matter. Um, at least for a contract that just says hello world. All right. So let's deploy that and let's test it on my machine first and see how that works. So, all right. So we got our variable button right here. So let's press that. Let's call it. All right. We get our string. Hello world. Good. Beautiful. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to switch this environment to injected web three. All right. There you go. Now we have injected web three and you can see it's interacting with Ropstein test network. Okay. Uh, if you guys look over here at the top right corner of my browser, you guys are going to see my MetaMask extension. Now I've already used, I've already deployed a contract um, from my MetaMask in this browser before, but if you haven't, you're probably going to get a prompt or a little pop-up from MetaMask saying, Hey, do you approve of this transaction? So just click accept. Okay. Uh, as long as you're using remix.ethereum.org, not some kind of fake website that's going to steal your digital assets from your MetaMask wallet. But yeah, so this, my MetaMask is already integrated with this, but if yours isn't, you're going to get a little pop-up. You're just going to click accept. Okay. So now instead of deploying to my virtual machine or deploying to the JavaScript virtual machine locally, we're actually going to deploy it to Ropstein, Ropstein test network and do the same exact thing. Just click deploy. And here MetaMask is going to pop up and it's going to ask us to approve a gas fee. So let's see what that looks like. All right. So it wants us to approve a gas fee of 0.00026 ETH, uh, and this is test ETH, all right, Ropstein test network ETH, all right, so I'm going to confirm that, and that guy is signed, so it should be good to go, and if you look at the bottom right here, it's creating the hello contract, which again, if you guys, this is just a contract called hello, so if we give it a second, I know the banner is at the bottom kind of covering this up, but here's a better look. Do you guys want to see what it actually looks like? So again, you get your block number and your transaction index ID. And yeah. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm Josh from ELP, and I'm out.